Hi everybody, this is Elizabeth with Live Simple, Live Free. I haven't done a Love High Alarm box in a while, an, uh, an unboxing with my tea over here. Um, I haven't done one in a while and I definitely wanted to do one. Love High Alarm is a subscription service from Israel and um, I love supporting uh, these small farms, businesses, uh, artisans, um, people that do wonderful cosmetics. They're all in the like Judea, Samaria areas, um, in, in absolutely the heart of Israel. So I really love getting this subscription box and I love sharing it with you guys. I love Haolam means heart of the world. And um, I, I'm not getting any uh, you know, they don't give me anything for doing this at all. I, I'm just happy to share it with you because I love doing these openings with you. Of course, I'm here in Florida. So let's see what's in the one for this um, this time. Um, they are usually themed, and so that's kind of fun. And aren't these pretty? It's my uh, Pioneer Woman scissors for the kitchen. Um, I am going to be getting very soon here a kind of a real good uh, grand tour and glimpse into the kitchen stuff and especially all the Pioneer Woman stuff. But for right now, let's take a look and see what we have in the, this Love High Alone box. There we go. Oh. It says, Welcome to Springtime. Uh, well, this has got stuff about Passover. Um, I didn't open this immediately. We've had a lot going on. So, um, but Esting is still a very pertinent time of year. And there's a beautiful little book in here um, about Passover. Oh, yeah. Um, as usual, like photographs and uh, beautiful illustrations. I find their books to always be very, very interesting. So this will be cool to read this. It's just all about um, Passover. Neat. Okay. Now, as usual, it's visually quite stunning because they, they always stick to like their theme and the packaging and everything is just quite beautiful. First of all here, I'm definitely seeing what looks like it's going to be some lovely extra virgin olive oil. I love the olive oil I've gotten from them. This is from the heart of the Negev, N-E-G-E-V. On untouched land among golden sand dunes, Halutza lies in a region where, until not so long ago, the foot of man had yet to tread. That is until a decade ago when a group of young enthusiastic people arrived directly from the uprooted settlements of Gush Katif to establish three new settlements and continue their dream of settling the land of Israel. So a short distance from the Gaza Strip, less than a kilo kilo kilometer from the Egyptian border, hothouses, orchards, vineyards, chicken coops, a barn and houses were built. Olive trees were planted in the sandy soil and today they produce delicious high quality land of Israel olive oil so yeah oh i always really love their olive oil it's really good and we use it all the time okay let's see here oh, it says freedom which is what you know passover was definitely all about oh goodness yum the jerusalem Chocolate Boutique, a fruit and nut milk chocolate bar. Um, chocolate since 2007. And of course, it's going to be, um, there's going to be a little booklet telling you all about all the different people that produce this. And um, this is from the Jerusalem Chocolate Boutique. <laughs> I should save some for Carly when I see her again. <laughs> Oh yeah, oh I love these. Um, Judea spices, I've had the green spice. These are spices from Judea um, and they're wonderful. The concoction of this mixture was inspired by carpets. I, mean, I read better without my glasses. 
by carpets of yellow flowers that cover the hills of the land of Israel in the springtime. Ooh, this is good for roast potatoes, chicken or turkey, and vegetable soup. Oh, yum. It's got all sorts of different kinds of herbs in it. I hope this box is not blocking me too much here. Oh, cumin. I'm definitely smelling cumin. I love cumin. Yep, there it is. Cardamom. Oh, so many good things in here. Mmm. Oh, that smells good. And the little booklet is going to have a recipe in it where you can, they actually use this, the spices. I'm sure of that. Okay, this is matzah uh, from matzot. Uh, matzo, uh, matzo, yeah, chocolate flavored. Oh, yike. Oh, the people took their dough before it was leavened and their kneading troughs were bound up in their clothes upon their shoulders and they baked cakes from the unleavened dough which they brought forth out of Egypt because they were thrust out of Egypt and could not tarry, neither had they prepared themselves any victual. So they used the flat unleavened bread. And this is actually with chocolate. It's actually baked with cocoa. Oh, yum. Once again, beautiful box. This is from um, Yehuda Matzos Moshe Lidmir and Sons um, in Jerusalem. Cool. Oh, 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 oh. I love when they include ceramics. Oh, how beautiful. Batra Erdstein, the mother of six, lives with her husband Baruch and their children on the rolling hilltops above Itamar, Shamron. There they develop the land by planting trees and gardens and encouraging visitors from all over the world to visit their ceramic studio and take part in the blessings of Israel. This vase is unique, it's handmade, hand painted. No other vase is exactly the same. Oh, yes, lovely. I'm so excited. All right, let me see what this looks like. Cool. The ceramics have all been beautiful, and I have used them and, and, and displayed them. Oh. Oh, it's lovely. Oh. It's just a, like a bud vase. Look at this. Oh man, it's beautiful. They're all individually made and I will definitely be using that. <laughs> That's pretty cool. And of course we have the booklet. It tells us about current things in Israel and um, oh, look at this. All oh, the fields of lavender. Oh, I just love lavender. And then there's going to be information about all the different people that are involved in this box and um, recipes, articles, and uh, yeah. And of course, this one will have kind of an emphasis on Passover. Okay, rosehip and saffron. Oh, saffron is very valuable um, spice. Anti-aging face cream, okay. Gift of nature. It's got all sorts of like botanicals and stuff in it. Saffron and rose hips and pomegranate. It's Gift of Nature is a family-run boutique offering fine natural cosmetics made in the village Bat Ayan nestled in the historic Judean Hills, Judean Hills. Our products made with love are produced using ancient techniques. Each creation has a deep connection to the land of Israel and benefits the body and soul. We use local medicinal herbs and the finest natural ingredients. Ah, let's see what this is like. And of course, once again, always the, the boxes are just gorgeous. Let's see here. I mean, look at the, look at the box and everything. They just package it so beautifully. Face cream. Now let's see here. I always try a little bit out of my hand first because my skin is so incredibly sensitive. 
I generally have had no trouble because the products are just so natural. Um, if there's ever been something that didn't quite work for my skin, um, I had a very happy granddaughter and daughter-in-law that would be very happy to use it. That is a text on my phone. I'll get it later. Oh, very. I don't think it's got much scent at all, which is fine. All right, let's rub this on. Ooh, I guess it'll be on my nose. Oh, now there's a real gentle, oh, really pretty, pretty smell. Oh, very delicate, very floral. It's full of natural botanicals. Stuff like this always makes me feel like I'm at some kind of a, a nice spa of some sort. Ooh, oh, that's nice cream. Ooh, okay. Uh, I like that. Okay, now there's one more in here. Oh, wonderful. From the same company, Gift of Nature. This is now a natural hand cream, rose hip and fig. Um, I keep stuff like this um, handy, either like in the bathroom or in my purse to be able to use it. Oh, once again, such a pretty box. Just really delicate, lovely. Everything's a spring theme. And um, it's really beautiful. Okay, now this would be the hand cream, so I guess I'll put it on my other hand. <laughs> I'm looking forward to seeing Carly again. So much fun doing these with her and trying to guess what's going to be in there. So I'm, I'm excited to see the kids, the kids again, kids and grandkids. Okay, now that's the hand cream. Ooh, smells so good. Should have turned my phone off, huh? I'll get that text in just a minute. Okay. Ooh, nice, nice. Really delicate, very floral once again, very botanical. All right. Oh yeah, that feels so good on my skin. Ah, oh, makes my skin happy. So, all right. Well, I'll be looking and reading more about a Passover and looking more at the little booklet that they have here with information about all these different um, people that are producing these products. So, I'll set this right there. I don't know how much you can see it. Boy, is it pretty. So, I'm very thrilled with this one. So, um, I will leave a link uh, in the description below. Love High Alum. It's easy to find. And um, they, you can just shop online or, you know, there is a subscription service. So, I'm very happy to support these um, these businesses and farms and uh, I always enjoy opening these with you so all right well I love you guys live simple live free and we will see you soon be blessed love you <laughs> bye bye